weekend in South Carolina. We are in Fair Play, like we told you guys already. And um, so last week we got in, we explored a little bit, but we mainly just uh, relaxed, set up, and got ready for our day because it was just a Sunday. Um, so Aaron worked all week and now he's off this weekend. So we're off to do some exploring. We're gonna go to Clemson University and see that campus. Um, maybe go to Greenville, which is like a big city near there. And I don't know, I don't know what else. We're on like the west side, west side, right? We're gonna just explore this area. The Appalachian Mountains are like, maybe like an hour, 30 minutes away. I don't know how far away, but they're really close. So we might go see that maybe tomorrow or something, but yeah. That's about it. Clemson University spring football game. Got in for free, but it's cold, so it we got, is cold. Some, got some beanies. Oh my god. My turn. Okay. No, I'm just kidding. I can't. <laughs> hey guys, we're leaving Clemson now. Um, we ended up going to their spring football game that they were having. Um, it was free and so we went and we stayed for the first quarter. It was really fun. Um, it was fun to watch some football and we walked around the Clemson campus and it was really beautiful and stuff. But um, it's really cold here so we couldn't take the cold anymore. But yeah. Now we're gonna go to Greenville, which is um, a pretty big city in South Carolina. And we're just gonna explore there and see what there is to do, yeah. restaurant the spotted pig barbecue which is right outside um, the little town that we're staying in and it's so cute it's just a little country town but it was really good really really good good portions too yeah but now we're gonna head back home and just relax for the evening and yeah we'll see you guys tomorrow bye, bye y'all good morning guys good morning it is Sunday morning and we are headed out to do some exploring. We're gonna go to the west side um, and maybe get into North Carolina, 
Georgia, I don't know, somewhere. But um, we're gonna go into the Appalachian Mountains. So we're just gonna drive over there. We found a little town that looks super cute. Um, so we're gonna drive over there and um, just see what there is to see, see how beautiful it's gonna be. Apparently there's waterfalls and yeah. maybe like some sort of like gorge or something. So yeah, we're just gonna go exploring. But yeah, we got all our stuff, got our backpack, all our camera gear, hiking gear, just in case, snacks, water, we're ready to go. So yeah, let's go. State Park and that is where the Tolua Gorge is and a bunch of waterfalls and um, we stopped at a scenic overlook and saw the gorge and it was so beautiful um, but now we're at the State Park and apparently you can get a better look at it and waterfalls and stuff like that so we're gonna go do that come on you can hear the waterfall and the rapids that's crazy And a little snack.
We got this. We are climbing down a bunch of stairs. I think, is it called the Heavens? On the map, I can't remember. It's like Heavens Falls or something. It's supposed to be like 310 steps going down 200 feet in elevation. Look, nothing will be as bad as the one time I hiked up the top of Machu Picchu on this really crazy hike that they said you had to be prepared for, like train for months, all this stuff. And me and my friends did it super fast. And then we had to get back to our bus. It was in college. We had to get back to our bus that was leaving in like 30 minutes. It takes two hours to get down and we sprinted down. I'm surprised you didn't break anything. There weren't stairs, too. And he was like, no. I was like, okay. That's mine. He was like, no. And then he started sprinting. Gotta keep them on their toes. Wait, what'd you say? Gotta keep them on your toes? No, stay in the camera again. No, you're gonna hurt me. I wanna be in the camera. Got it. Ah. <laughs> I knew you were gonna hurt me. <laughs> oh. You got me good. Mini Bobini Foschini. Alright. Great hike. Really loved it. Whoa. Really loved it. And we're gonna get some reward of getting a coconut snow cone. And then we're gonna go into this cute little town that we saw on the map, so it looks fun. And we'll probably get something to eat there and then just head back to the house and relax for the evening. Thank you guys for coming along. You wanna wait? Okay guys, so we just went to the snow cone stand and the guy that was 
you know, making our snow cone, he had on a cowboy hat, cowboy boots, and this belt buckle that said Texas on it. It was pretty cool. And I was like, oh, I like your, I like your belt buckle. And then I asked him if he was from Texas and he was like, no. And he said that he visited Texas in for Thanksgiving or something. And he said he loved it so much. And he literally said, if he could move anywhere, he would move to Texas. And we were like, really? We're like, that's so crazy. Cause we think around here in the Carolinas and yeah. the mountains and everywhere is so beautiful. It's crazy to me that people would want to move away from here. I mean, Texas is great. Yeah, Texas is beautiful. But it's crazy they want to move away from there, here yeah. to Texas. But anyways. And I guess when you live somewhere and you grow up there, you're not as grateful for how mm -hmm. beautiful and however, I think we love Texas. And it's one of the things you always go back and forth is, do we want to settle down there? Do we want to look for other places? But it is just cool to hear that from other people that they think Texas is. <laughs> so amazing. but. Thanks for coming along on our hike. And uh, now we're going to go check out some, uh, Dillard. Not Dillard's, but the town Dillard. Yeah. Bye bye, mountains. Hey guys, so we just got done with dinner. Um, we're at this really cool restaurant called the Dillard House. It's up on the top of a hill um, in Dillard. I almost said Dillard, Texas. In <laughs> Dillard, um, Georgia, actually. We're on the other side of the border right now. Um, but yeah, it's so cool. It's been here for a really long time. It's attached to a like um, hotel inn type thing. And um, anyways, it's really cool. But we were looking at the list of people that had oh, been oh, here. Yeah. And it was like Thomas Edison, Henry Ford, all these other people. It was crazy. Um, but the food was so good. They serve it to you family style, so you don't get a menu or anything. They just bring you the food. Oh, and so um, we'll show you the video of the food here. Um, but yeah, it was really good. They had fried chicken, chicken fried steak, cream corn, mashed potatoes, rolls, um, maple glazed carrots, oh, yeah. green beans, um, cheesy coleslaw this like cinnamon butternut squash um is that everything? did i say mashed potatoes and gravy i don't know a but lot yeah, of good stuff it was so freaking good so it was really fun and then now we're just gonna kind of explore maybe um but then we'll probably head back soon because it's getting later in the evening and we want to rest before the week starts so yeah and we'll uh show you guys what we're looking at 